All right, guys, let's do this. We're gonna create the ultimate sandbox dinosaurs park at Isla Nublar. And as you can see, I did some terraforming, deleted all the trees that were in our map. The only thing I couldn't terraform was this little area, but we're gonna use this area for our Hammond creation lab to incubate all our dinosaurs for the rest of the park. My name is The Lady Designer. Please make sure to subscribe if you want to see more of this ultimate sandbox park. And please leave a like if you like the video, of course. Let's see, what are we gonna do? We're gonna start creating a little main street area over here with some shops. And I really want to put this innovation center somewhere in the middle because I really like this innovation center and it has a different path going in different directions so I really think that this would be awesome somewhere in the middle with another some kind of main street area with all kinds of shops and restaurants and that kind of stuff so that is at least a goal and of course we're gonna have a lot of enclosures with different types of animals i do have all the dinosaurs right now at a hundred percent so it's gonna be amazing and let's see how far we can go with this map let me just start here with a large the only thing i don't have like i have unlocked all the buildings except for the medium power station but since i have the large power station i don't really feel that i need to get that one too so let me put him right in this corner as much as we can over here and let's just put you down over here because i do need power on that side too and let's see if we can make an enclosure right over here for our Hammond Creation Lab. So we can incubate our dinosaurs really soon. And we also need an ACU center to transport them. So let's see how can we place those. Where are you? ACU center. So can I squeeze you in right over here? That would be amazing, but I don't think I can. I need to put you more like this. Okay, let's do that then. And then we're gonna put the Hammond Creation Lab right over here in this corner. And hopefully we can connect a fence to it. So we have a little space, we don't need that much space, but at least a little space so we can use as much space as possible here for just enclosures. Um, let's grab the power one. Um, let's go like that. And let's go a little bit straight over here and just connect you it doesn't need to be perfect in this little area because this is not our main park so this will be the main park and somewhere in the middle um i want to place two ranger facilities i don't even know what the normal name is ranger stations okay so we can feed all the dinosaurs and get to uh, get quickly to all the enclosures of course okay so that is connected let's connect some paths right over here and like that and connect you and connect you and we need a substation in this corner oh this is perfect and connect that one so we need to connect the path to there so maybe we just go right along this side since it's like a backstage road so let's see Shall we also already put some shops over here? Let's do that. Let's grab the fancy path and go straight. One and two, like that. And then have, let's see, what shall we place here? 
for the entrance. Let's have a restaurant. And let's keep some space for the backstage path. So let's connect you as close as possible. Um, shall we just have a corner right over here? A bending. Let's do that. And then go right over here. And I'll go back. Okay, a restaurant as close as possible right over here. And then have a bowling alley next to it. As close as we can get. Ooh, there we go. And a clothing shop on the other side. So that could be right over here. And then have a fossil zone. Oh, I want you on that side. Can we expand that road a little bit? Just a little bit. There we go. Let's have a fossil center on that side. Oh, that's not a fossil center. There you go. Like that. And have... What was that? A clothing shop. So let's have a bar on this side then. Oh, I like you on that side too. Okay, let's wait with the bar. And... The arcade. I like the arcade. So let's have you... Right over here. And then uh, maybe we should put in a path in the middle. Like that. And then have the bar. So there's the bar. It's still not really aligned over here. So maybe we can have another path in between. So let's have another card. Let's see if we can do this. Can we delete that end piece? No, it's gonna delete it all. Let's see if we can do it differently. That's not working. Well, maybe we can have a pathway. Let's see if that works. Wait, then we can do like that. A path going around it. Is that possible? Let's try it from the other side. Okay, maybe a little bit further. There we go. Okay, I don't like that little piece, so let's try that again. Yes, there we go. And now hopefully we can connect that side too. And... Oh, that's a little bit too far. Okay, try it again. There we go, awesome. Oh, it's too close. The other side. There we go, awesome. Okay, can we now delete that little wobbly thingy? Yes, great. Okay, so we do have our main street. Okay, we have a big space right over here, but I think it's fine. We should have maybe placed that one a little bit to the left to align it more with the bowling alley. But I'm happy with this. I'm happy with this. And now what I want to do is grab maybe a light steel fence. Okay, and then a 
just want this to be perfectly aligned if we can. I think that's good. I think that's good. And then a little bit further, or shall we? Okay, let's do it like that. And then maybe we can have it like this. Great. And then maybe a little bit more on this side. And hopefully we can fill in with some trees to give it a little bit more of a nice feeling. Okay, let's see. Oh, I was afraid it wouldn't work. Okay, let's try this again. Let's delete it. <laughs> there are the trees. Okay, let's put it a little bit more in the back. What what fence is better to look at? That one or well, that one. I think this one because this is not for the enclosure, so... Okay, let's see if we can do this. Ah, yeah, there we go. Is it straight? No, it's not. No, it's not. It's not Planet Coaster, so we have to work with the stuff we have, right? Okay, but still I need to delete the tree so I can see it, if it's aligned to the path. There we go. And then go straight over here. And then just go to this little piece. And then oh, we don't really need a fence going like that. So let's put in some trees. Look at all those little birds flying from the trees. Okay. There we go. Okay, it's not that many trees as I was hoping for, but maybe we can have a little bit more on this side too then. Not really sure if we will keep those trees, but let's do the same thing on that side. There we go. And then play some trees. much as we can and then go with this path and use the fancy path in the shopping areas and let's connect the power let's see where can we place you to have as much power as we want I think this would work because it will cover them all Maybe on this side too? Okay, that could work too. So we can have two. But that will re remove a lot of trees, I'm afraid. Yep, it did. Well, let's just keep it like this and then we will connect the power lines to our power station as close to the border as possible so you won't notice it that much there we go and we got power if I'm right no we don't oh because they are not connected yet let's upgrade our power station output output and another output, and then... I don't know if we will get any output, so... Let's just... Have one protection. I don't know, I think we will be fine in sandbox mode. Okay, so let's connect that path. With our backstage pathway. Also, as close to the border as possible. 
There we go. So the path system is now connected. So let's just fill this with a little bit of tree. So it's a little bit covered. Well, it's not working that much, but we do our best. Okay, so we do have the ACU center. We need to upgrade you. Let's have a reload speed. Accuracy and scheduling. There we go. Awesome. So let's see. We do have our shops here. I don't think we do have people in our park. Do we? No, we don't. We need dinosaurs for that. Alright, let's see. Shall we already incubate some dinosaurs? And let's just start like when you go to a zoo, you mostly start with like the not dead important dinosaur maybe like the not that special so I'm thinking of those guys or maybe or these truthiomimus those guys or the gallimimus that could also be... Which one is the best? I think it's the Gallimimus. Um, 17, 18. Let's give you a longer lifespan. Or maybe we can combine those. I want you to be a coastal, coastal pattern gene. To have a coastal pattern gene. I think you already have... Okay, cardio strength and I want them to live as long as possible for our dinosaur park the moon response and brain aging the, this one cardio strength and let's have another brain aging. So let's incubate at least five of those or four. Let's go for four. Um, success rate and hatchery capacity. Let's have some more. I I'm going for four so we can maybe combine it with those other guys. Uh, okay, so let's see. Where shall we start? Shall we just put those guys right over here? No, maybe right over here how much space do we have in this corner oh look how bad this is aligned oh i can stand it i need to fix that okay there we go i think this is already much better than it was before okay so let's see so the guests come in right over here oh, we do need that ranger station somewhere okay let's start and build that innovation center so i can see where we can maybe place that i think i want to place it right over here yeah let's place that one right over here let's have a fancy path going straight From here okay maybe we will make this a fancy path too and connect them nicely with a nice little bend so let's upgrade you and go straight to here and then if we can let's see on the map yeah I think this could work I think this could work and then have some more shops on this side so let's have oh we do need a hotel don't we hmm oh, we don't need it but it increases our island visitor capacity so hmm where shall we build that one how do you look if we place like Maybe one over here. I'm not really sure because I like this to be like an eye catcher all over the park. So we might 
want to place our hotel maybe right over here so it also has these shops maybe we can have two on both sides i think that could work let's delete these fences and have a hotel right over here if we can squeeze you in hopefully we can i think that path is a little bit interfering oh there was a little corner okay so let's try this no power yeah i can imagine you don't have any power left because i'm building so many things and not everything is connected so let's have you as close as possible on this side and let's have another one on the other side i'm not really sure if i will keep two depends a little bit how it will look and on that side they're so big so i don't know oh, i like that innovation center oh, that's so cool okay shall we have a path going around it since we do have more exits or entrances i don't know we could have a path going around it let's see and that one's a little bit closer so i think this is okay let's look on the map i think this is pretty decent maybe we can delete those and make it a little bit wider okay let's try that Okay, a little bit wider. Hmm, I don't know if I like this. <laughs> no, let's just put it back how we had it. Hopefully I'm able to do that. I don't think it's, I'm able to do it how I did it the first time. Let's just keep it and, and forget about it. And <laughs> let's just place these pots here. Can we fill this? I'm not sure we can, but we could maybe try to fill it as much as possible. No, I didn't really like the filling up, so let's just keep it like this. Oh, that looks gorgeous. Okay, let's put some more shops over here. So let's have... Can we go around it? Well, we can, but it will probably don't look that good. Will it? Oh, I like the hotels, but they're just so massive. Like, I don't really like them right over here. I'm not sure. I, I prefer them having them in this corner or something. Well, we might change that. We might change that. Let's just put some shops right over here. This is the gift shop, so let's have fast food right on the other side. And let's see. A toy shop? We don't have a toy shop yet. Do we have something else with a nice little corner? Oh, that's the wrong side. Let's see. Bowling alley. Well, let's have the bowling alley. Well, it's a little bit bigger than I was hoping for. Okay, do we have something else that's small? Toy shop. Arcade. Well, that one is small. Maybe too small. But I think I will go for the arcade. Can we fill that keys up with 
No, we can't. Okay, then I'm gonna align him. So let's have the arcade. No, that one is also blue. I want something else. I want something else. Clothing shop. Okay, let's just go for the clothing shop. Just to have a little bit of variation over here then. And then have just one pathway going around it. If we can. There we go. Maybe we can connect it. This too. Let's see. How much we can use this path to. And still make it look nice. That's a little bit of a glitch, or I don't know. Okay, let's keep it like this, and then... Okay, have a pathway over here. And then have another pathway right over here. If we can. Let's see. Can we now delete you? Yes! Awesome! Look at that, that's awesome. I really like this. And then we can have some trees around it but we still we first need to make sure where we will go further for our enclosures i really think i want to remove these hotels i really don't like them over here so i'm gonna remove them and i think i will place them in this little corner over here and they might want to have some more shops but we will give them we will give them or maybe we can just connect this path over here to the hotels. I think that could work too. And then we can incubate our dinosaurs. I was hoping to have that in the first episode, but hey, uh, first things first, we need to have some space for our shops and that kind of stuff. And oh, it's gonna be awesome, hopefully. <laughs> Let me know in the comments what you think and please make sure to leave a like at the video because it really does help the channel. And subscribe, of course, if you want to see more of this sandbox park and I'm gonna do my best to make it as beautiful as possible. Thank you guys so much for watching. Please let me know in the comment section when you, what you think of this start of our sandbox ultimate dinosaur park. And I really hope to see you in the next episode. Thank you guys so much for watching. Bye guys.